everybody. Uh, it's Rob here from Intrigue with uh, tip 10 on day 10 of 100 tips in 100 days. This one is a bit more around your team and teams in general um, and this concept around identity versus role training and how you can maybe look at building self-confidence and self-worth within the, the folks at your company. So uh, the nature of the, these videos, like I said before, is to put teeth into our purpose of intrigue, which is empowering leaders to strengthen communities. And this is, you know, try, test, and true stuff. You know, we've been on the Canada's list of the top growing 500 companies for four years in a row. So it's like, this is actually stuff that works in the field. It's stuff that we've learned through a whole bunch of scar tissue and, you know, wish we had learned earlier so we could have maybe grown a bit more efficiently or effectively. So I hope you can get some tips from it. Uh, so this one is around roadmaps. And I've talked a little bit about it before, uh, but this idea is that uh, it kind of stems from uh, training. So typically in organizations, when you when you join up and you get onboarded, uh, you get trained for your role, and you get taught you know processes and you know key performance indicators, and hopefully you get some clarity in terms of what it takes to win in your role, so that you can contribute to the overall goals of the company. Now, most of that stuff is tied to role-based training. Very few. Uh, organizations are working on identity-based training and so this idea of IR theory uh, is that a lot of people focus their self-worth or think their self-worth is tied to their role performance and this happens when we're children you know if we uh, get a good grade on uh, a test we're a good kid you know you score the winning goal in a hockey game you're a good kid um, and so you know role performance gets tied to self-worth if you get like an F on a report card you know there's maybe not a good conversation with your parents and so we get conditioned to think that how well we do in our roles, it, it equates to what we're, our self-worth is and our self-confidence. And this is just so far from the truth. You know, our self-worth is completely not tied to our role performance. You know, I, I'm proof of that, I think, when I started playing hockey when I was like 22 years old uh, with uh, business partner Paul. You know, him and his, all his friends were flying around because they are just amazing hockey players and I was falling over. You know, every time I tried to shoot the puck, I couldn't skate backwards. But just because I wasn't any good at hockey didn't mean I'm what, not a person with self-worth. And so what we do at Intrigue is these things called roadmaps, and then roadmaps help us understand what the priorities are at work, but also in a whole bunch of other categories in someone's life. Things like relationship goals, financial goals, vacation goals, books to read goals, stop doing goals, personal goals, people to meet goals. Um, and this, this just helps people understand, like, outline what are some of the things they want to accomplish in like a three, six, maybe three, six month, one year, maybe long term. Um, and, and, and write it down because we know that the chances of something coming to life when written down is more than double. Uh, it's probably 10 times more likely actually. Uh, and then as we start to review these every 90 days, we can actually see what's been accomplished. We turn those boxes green, move them down to the bottom. And then over you know, the course of a year or two, we can really start to see all the things that someone has accomplished, not only at Intrigue, but in their entire life. And that really helps build confidence because people then become, you know, they become very conscious of what they're able to do. Uh, and it's just been amazing to see all the different green boxes that have kind of occurred over the last like you know decade at entry with all of our team members. So the whole idea is roadmaps. We do them um, every 90 days with each team member. Everybody gets a roadmap, um, and it really helps build their eye, their identity, and self worth because they can see what's uh, being done on a you know 90 day basis. So if you if you want the template, I'm happy to share it. Just ask for it in the comments, and I'll and I'll send it to you a private message. Um, and if you have any questions or comments, please let me know. And I hope this one helps. This is tip number 10 in day 10 of 100 tips in 100 days. All right, see ya. Bye.